We're talking about the man who caught national attention leading Tennessee police on a manhunt. Kirby Wallace, here's his picture right here. He will appear in court today. News Force Bethany Reese is live for us at the courthouse in Stewart County. We know he's facing murder charges, among others. So, Bethany, tell our, re our viewers this morning what is expected to happen in court today. Yeah, hey, good morning, Holly. Now, this is the day that he stands for arraignment, which means he faces this indictment that the grand jury put out. Now, they're on this page alone, there's five counts, nine in this indictment total. Let's talk about a couple of those that are the major ones that he'll be facing this morning. The grand jury indicted him on nine accounts, first degree murder, one of them, felony murder, aggravated kidnapping, aggravated arson, just to name a few. Now, if you remember, this manhunt for Wallace started back on September 22nd after he was suspected of killing two people in two different counties. The 14 day manhunt ended in early October, October 5th, when Wallace was found in a wooded area in Stewart County. And when asked why he ran, Wallace says he feared for his life. Now, back in his first court appearance, I've been saying this all morning, he said, I didn't commit those murders. Well, today he faces this indictment that says he's being charged with murder. We're going to see if he says guilty or not guilty. Back to you guys.